Hey everybody, Eric here from Around To It Videos, and you know me as Joe Handsome 99 here on YouTube. And today we're doing a Movie Edit Pro tutorial on the Matrix special effects. And what I'm going to show you here today is the uh, the special effects, like if you remember the Matrix movie, where they're being shot at it and they dodge from side to side, miss the bullets. Uh, I can show you that effect today. It's really simple. To and do. if you don't have Movie Edit Pro, these same techniques can be used in... Uh, other video editing software packages as well. But anyway, let's get started. And here you see the uh, Movie Edit Pro. I've already got it open in the timeline mode. We're going to drop the first video clip down on the timeline. And I really don't need the audio for this, for what this uh, special effect is. So left click on the, uh, the video while it's on the timeline, hit Control M. This separates the audio from the video, and we're just going to delete the audio track because we don't need it. All right, now I'm going to grab the start marker and watch. Okay, he's doing the dodging like he's dodging bullets right there. Okay, and let's see where he starts to dodge. Right there. Okay, that's at three seconds, so we're going to back up to about there. I'm going to hit T to separate the video into two clips. I'm going to delete the first part because that's just extra video that I don't need. Alright, now what we're going to do, we're going to find out where he starts to dodge again. Right there. Alright, so hit the T key again. We've separated the video into two clips. And the reason we did that is this is the, the start starting point where we're going to begin this special effect and how we're going to do this is left click on the video clip where he's where your subject starts to do the move hold the control key down left click and hold and drag I just made a copy of that we've got an exact copy of that video and I'm going to do it again and again because I need three copies for this special effect now this is what we're going to do we're going to right click one time zoom to one frame because we have to do this one frame at a time and how you get that special effect is the first the, the video clip on track two you need to offset it and we're going to offset it by three frames from the first video and then the video on track three is going to be offset by three frames from the video above it and so on. Now let's hit the uh, the fit button down here at the bottom so we can look at the video overall again. And this is how you do the special effect. You have your original video track on uh, track one and then you have your other videos which will give you that fast speedy looking effect the dodging effect on track two three and four but we're not done quite yet left click on the on track two on your the videos that are below the original track can hit the control key and highlight the second and third ones now see I've just selected all three video tracks at the same time what you want to do now is grab that top middle handle on the video it's right there in the middle it's a little square so every video has a handle we want to grab the top the top middle one and what we want to do is we want to reduce the brightness of the videos on tracks two three and four about well about that much maybe about reduce it from a hundred percent down to about forty now I refer to this as the brightness of the video. Some uh, video programs refer to this as the opacity or the fade. Uh, Movie Edit Pro refers to it in the manual as brightness, so that's what we're going to call it here, brightness. Anyway, you see I've reduced the brightness of the three extra video clips by about 60%. And that allows you to have them faded in or blended in 
with the video on track one. And what you end up with is something that looks like this. Now that looks pretty cool, doesn't it? And it only took me really about a minute to do it. Anyway, here's the punching video. You see, you can play around with this and do whatever you want to with it. But uh, it just gives you all kinds of ideas. So you see, it was very easy. Put your, uh, your video on track one. Find uh, your starting point where you want to do your special effect. Hit the T key, split that video. Make multiple copies of it. Lag the videos by about three frames on each line. And then reduce the brightness on them. And that's it. Export it to your uh, favorite video format and upload it to YouTube or impress all your friends and family at home with it. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video tutorial and thanks for watching. We'll catch you later.